guys, it's Katie. So, spur of the moment vlog, because I wasn't expecting to do this at all um, or film today. We are getting ready to go thrifting. Um, we're going, me and my brother and Everly are going to run to the so local thrift store and then Goodwill. And Goodwill's having a sale on their hoodies and sweatshirts and sweaters. So we're gonna go. I thought I was oh. kidding. Like, no. Like, this is the cutest little outfit. <laughs> Do you, you don't like your outfit? And look, guys, she scratched her eye. Everly, why'd you do that? <coughs> okay, okay, say bye. All right, guys, so I just got back from thrifting. And so I'm gonna, I didn't vlog a lot in there. I didn't, well, I didn't vlog any in there. Cause there was a ton of people in both places. Like, I don't know. I mean, I understand Goodwill because they had a really good sale. All of their women's anything long sleeves was 49 cents a piece. And so there was a bunch of people in there, plus the way my Goodwill is and this, and so we have two around where I live, but the other one's like 25 minute drive and the one that's like five minutes from my house is attached to our Y and they have it like cut out. So you can hear like people splashing and cause the pool is literally right on the other side of this half cut wall kind of weird but we got Everly in the pack <laughs> what are you doing sister what are you doing can you say hi we are pulling ourselves up on everything so it's been fun and then but so I got this ginormous bag of a bunch of different stuff for me and her. And then I have some things from Hobby Lobby that I got last week that I got. Hobby Lobby is having, I think they're still having, I might be wrong, 90% off their spring stuff. She's just gonna creep, we got Mia. Oh. Another side note, it's Mia's gotcha day. We've had her for two years now. Happy gotcha day, Mia. Come here. Come here. Yep, two years. And happy, happy two years. All right, go lay down. Oh, thanks. All right, so let's go ahead thought that was my dad um let's start with the Hobby Lobby stuff because there's less there and some of this stuff will make ah. sense in a couple weeks you'll understand why I got some of this stuff so first thing I got is this cactus like black sign it says adventure I don't know if you can kind of okay there now you can read it even though it's up backwards here but it was originally $19.99. Yep, and I paid $1.99 for it. Then I got an M. They're like wicker. We got an M and an E. And these were originally $24.99 and I paid $2.00 and 49 cents a piece. Then I got this thing. It's just, I have, it's just a decor piece, but it says spread your happy wishes. And I got it for, I got all of these pieces for Everly's room. We're re, kind of redoing it, so, um, but again, this was originally $11.99 and I only paid $1.19 for it. I got this really cute basket and it was originally $19.99 and I only paid $1.99 for it. And then I've been eating new plates. 
but like not glass plates, just <laughs> just like acrylic plates that we can just throw in the microwave and stuff. So I got four of these little ones. Oh my goodness! Did you fall on your butt? Did you fall on your butt? I got four little plates and these were originally $2.99 a piece and I paid 29, 29 cents a piece for these. And then I got six of the big ones, which were originally that one with a price tag on it, $3.99 a piece and I only paid 39 cents a piece for them. Okay, and then this was probably my best find. I saw this on TikTok. Someone had posted about the sale and they had shown this piece and I was like, I am got to go to um, Hobby Lobby like right now. I have to try to find this piece. I have to stand up. Okay, so it is this sign. And it says, good night, little dreamer. But guys, it was originally 70, $80. It was $79.99 and I only paid $7.99 for it. Eight bucks for this two piece wall decor. And it only has like one little tiny chip. And all I gotta do is put like a piece of clear tape or glue it down or something. And that's it. And it's perfect condition. So, if you haven't already, check your Hobby Lobby. There's all different kinds of stuff. But let's go ahead and get on with the Goodwill. I'm gonna jump in here real fast. It's a different day, but I filmed the outro on this next part. So, I'm just gonna film this, put this here. Um, it's, so I filmed that part on Monday and it is, or Wednesday, when, Tuesday, Tuesday. Filmed that part on Tuesday and it is Thursday. I went back today, they had a sale yesterday. I went back yesterday, oh my God. Okay, went back yesterday. They had a sale on shoes and scarves. Scarves were 25 cents each. Shoes were a dollar. Um, so I'm gonna show you what I got yesterday. I got these Tommy Hilfiger sandals. They're a little big, but I feel like I can tighten them up a little bit more and they're gonna fit perfectly fine next summer. Um, but yeah, I only paid a dollar and they're in like perfect condition. Tommy Hilfiger. Okay, I got myself two scarves. This one, I didn't notice it had buttons on it. Huh. It needs washed, but it's just this red one, this burgundy one, and it's got some buttons on it, but I don't think you're going to be able to see that. I didn't see it. <laughs> so, and then I got this plaid one, just an infinity, good size, it works. And then I got one last thing yesterday, I got Everly this cute little sweater got some scalloped detailing at the bottom and a little peek there. I think it'd be really cute this winter. Okay, now today, sale. I just got back about 20 minutes ago. Um, it was all men's clothes were a dollar. So I got Joran a couple things and I got myself a couple things. Starting off, I got Joran these. These are really soft. <laughs> I got him these Wrangler jeans. Just Wrangler. They're very soft and I almost don't want him to wear these to work because I feel like they're gonna make his butt look really cute. And that's for me. Um, <laughs> is this for him or for me? Um, I got this for either one of us. It's just this like grayish green Everlast 
crew neck. If he doesn't like it, then I'm taking it. So then I got him just this old navy plain green t-shirt. Um, this one I have to try to get, there's a stain on it, but I feel like I'm gonna be able to get it out. This is for me. It is this Eddie Bauer crew neck. But as you can see, there is a stain right there. I have some OxyClean, so I'm gonna attempt to get it out. But if not, I can wear it around the house. I really don't care. I got Everly, these cute little joggers with a little bow. And these will be cute for this winter as well. I got, I'm just pulling out of the back, so whatever comes out, comes out. Again, I got this. If Jordan doesn't like it, I want it anyways. I got this Ohio State t-shirt. Just can't have enough of those, especially living here. Um, this is, this is St. John's Bay. Just this, I think it'll look really good on him for the winter. It's buttoned up. Maybe there's another button there, but it's just a burgundy-ish, burnt, kind of like a burnt brown, burgundy color with some buttons. This, I mostly got this to wear around the house, but I might wear it out. I don't know. Just this Everlast Sports giant hoodie crew neck. I love crew necks. I love going to the guy section for crew necks. And the last thing I got is Everly this plain black t-shirt because she has one, she actually has one on now, but uh, I think it's an 18 month one and this is 2T and it's starting to get, she has a, she has a big head and like her head circumference is like the 95th percentile, um, but she, uh, so She, I forgot what I was saying. You'll understand it a little bit when I tell you all. Oh, the black t-shirt is getting kind of difficult to put over her head, so I got her a 2T one just so it wasn't, and they're like 250 at Walmart, but this one was a dollar, so I wasn't passing it up. Um, depending on what their sale is tomorrow, I might go back for a fourth day. <sighs> So if I get anything tomorrow, I will insert that clip here. If I don't, then you will see me from Tuesday with the rest of the video. All right, so you guys remember me saying how I would come back if I got anything else? I'm back. I spent $3.75 today because kids' clothes were 25 cents a piece. So, I did get some boy things. Just in case our next one is a boy. I was like, this stuff's cute. I can't, I'm not gonna pass it up for a quarter. So, I'll start off with that. First things first, I got these old navy jeans. They're, I think, 12 months. I got this hoodie. It's Carter's. Just says best brother because if I do have a boy, he will be a brother. Um, this is probably one of the, my favorite pieces I got for the, a boy. It is um, Cat and Jack brand. It's got this like detailing. Oh, I love it so much. I also got this Wonder Kids, I don't know what, where that's from, um, little flannel, super cute, and I got these just blue, I think these are also, this is unbranded, they don't have a brand, just these blue like, almost like dress pants, I just thought they were adorable and I wanted them. Now this next one is... It was in the boys section, but I'm gonna put it on Everly. And then I'll put it, cause I think it's so cute and I 
pretty neutral. Um, it's just this Oshkosh brand, little fleece, um, half zip up, tribal print, I love it. And then the rest of it is for Everly. I got her these child of mine, a sleeper with some polar bears on it because you can never have enough sleepers. These are for her to wear now, the rest of the summer. It's these hot pink ruffly shorts. Those are her size now. I got this. This is a 2T, but I have 12 month PJs for her and this exact same. And they're like capris on her and the, I can't fit the shirt over her head. So I'm thinking this 2T will fit her come October because it is cute. It, it says cutest pumpkin patch and it's mini with a pumpkin. That's the top and then these are the pajama pants. Just has witch mini with some pumpkins and some stars. Again, a quarter for the set. I got, I've been eyeing this shirt for a few days now and I didn't get it because I was like, I don't know if that'll fit her. It's 18 months and now that I'm looking at it, I actually am happy I got it. It's just this pink, corally color shirt with some ruffles and some sparkles on it. Cute shirt for the winter. I got her these. Old Navy jean jeggings, I guess they are. They do have a little bit, as you can tell, a little bit of stitching, but for a quarter, I wasn't gonna pass up. We have, I have these in a smaller size and she outgrew them, but I absolutely adored her in these. They were so cute. So, and then I got her these shorts for that are size 3T for next summer, but they were so cute that I just had to have them for now. And then the last thing I got her is this Carter's striped mauve colored, just long sleeve t-shirt. I have a cute little mauve corduroy dress that you have to have a shirt underneath of it. And I think that would look really cute under it or a plain white one. So I have got that because it's the same color. It's the same color as the little bow. So that is all I got. So I'm gonna let you guys get back to the rest of the video from the first day I went thrifting. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna redo this part second time because Everly wouldn't stop screaming the first time I filmed it and it just wasn't going well. So, now it's time to show you all again what I got from thrifting. We stopped at this one thrift store first. Um, I had never been in it, but we went ahead and went in and their pricing was just kind of high for me. Like some of the stuff was just way overpriced than what I would pay for it. And so, but other stuff was really. Ah! Your bottle does not go in between your legs. The other stuff was really good priced. <laughs> So the only thing, I ended up only getting one thing, and it was these booties. They're granimals, so they're from Walmart, but they were only $1.50, size four, and I've been looking for booties for her for about a month now, just trying to prepare for winter, but I haven't been able to find a pair. I am gonna get her one more pair of boots, um, cause I want a brown pair, and maybe a black pair too, so I might get her two, but we will see what I find. I might have to just keep going thrifting. Okay, so Goodwill was having a really good sale, 49 cents on anything women's long to sleep. So I got a bunch of stuff. But first thing is an even long sleeve. 
I went to the men's section and I found this Yeti t-shirt. It just says Yeti coolers. And then on the back, it says Yeti, wildly stronger, keep ice longer. With these two Yetis, you know, holding a cooler. <laughs> We're just gonna go through. But I was like, like whatever it's a t-shirt it's cute I like the color we're gonna go for it so I got that then I got this sweater it's time and true it's just white but it's got I don't know if you can be able to tell it's got like gold like fabric thingy magic sequence stuff through it but for 49 cents can't pass it up I got this, I think it's Sienna Sky. Yep, Sienna Sky cardigan. And it's, I always call this stuff the fluff ball fabric because that's what it kind of looks like to me. It just looks like fluff balls. But I thought the color was really pretty and super cute. And this is Laura Scott, it's a sweater but feeling it now it kind of feels itchy so i don't know if i'd be able to wear this for a long time so i'm gonna try it on after i wash it and see if i think i'm gonna and try it on and see if i can wear it or not if i can't i'll just resell it i gotta make more than 50 cents back right so then Sanitary. This doesn't have a tag, so I have no idea what brand it is or even what size it is. But it's this, just this cardigan. It's got a hood. Thought it was super cute. Now, this next one, pretty sure it's a military jacket of some sort. Um, but I liked it and it's super soft and thick and cozy. So I got it. But it's this army green color and it's got a patch. Um, and then it's got like some, some like waffle knit material right there. But I'm gonna take the patch off and then I'm going to um, buy patches and put them on. Next thing I got was this cardigan. It is Dress Barn. I can figure out how it goes. It's just this cream colored beige cardigan with lace along the front but I thought it was super cute I think I'm saying that a lot oops now this next thing is from mud oh, crap. And it's kind of hard to show you it's like kind of like a short sleeved cardigan so but it's So it looks like this. So cute. Um, but yeah, that was also 49 cents, even though it wasn't long sleeve. I don't know. Then the last thing I got for myself was the was this these pajama pants with some polar bears on them i love polar bears so i had to get them plus i love flannel pj pants in the winter time this is all i will live in around here you'll see me in sweats in flannel pajama pants because i have 
I so Jordan and I had not last winter but the winter before we got matching red and black checkered pajama pants from Old Navy I got mine in the size I was before I was pregnant well now mine don't fit and neither does Jordan's fit him so now I have Jordan's so I need to get more Okay, so the last three things are for Everly. I got her this cheetah or leopard print crew neck sweatshirt. Um, I did get it in a size 2T. Um, I was like, it'll be oversized, it'll be cute. I just ordered her a cheetah print bow this morning. So once that gets here, I think this is just going to be so cute. So excited, I think some black jeans and some black boots I'm excited for winter fall really second thing I got next thing I got her is this little unicorn sleeper and this is Carter's but it was only 99 cents and then the last and final thing I got is these pair of Carter snow tips. I live in Ohio. Last year we didn't really get any snow. Hoping we get a little bit this year just so that I can take her outside. I think it'll be a lot of fun and go sledding. But if we don't get snow, then I keep them for maybe next year for another child or something. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But yeah, so that's about all I got today, guys. Um, if you haven't, go check out your Hobby Lobby. Maybe check to see, maybe your Goodwill's having some sales going on. Because I got all of that stuff. I didn't get the boots from there, but everything I got from Goodwill. So that all the clothes I showed you, $12 was my total. $12. Wait, come on. That's great. And then these were $1.50. So today in total I spent like $13.50. Then at Hobby Lobby my entire total was like $25 I think. Nothing, no more than $30 for everything at Hobby Lobby. This, this painting alone is $80. So, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here, but I just wanted to show you all what I got. So, if you haven't already, please give this video a big thumbs up. Please subscribe and comment, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.